Uh, yeah, this is Bang Bang Well. Um, just a little story, you know, and it is quite a good story, as happens. Um, Johnny Bindon um, was around with Joe Pyle, uh, popping and seeing Joe Pyle down for Joe Pyle's pub or something. Um, he had a talk with Warshaw, and he said, look, I want to get myself fit. So he started going down the pub, getting himself fit, all the counts. Uh, Warshaw was showing him a few bits and pieces, and, and as it happens, Johnny Bindon, who was one a bad fighter, was quite a good boxer. People couldn't really realise where well, he should always carry knives, you know. But he's down there with Roy Shaw and he's working out and he's learning bits and pieces from Roy. So he'd been with Roy about what? I think he came out in 1978, 79, uh, Johnny Bindon, from the, the murder, the murder trial, yeah? That murder trial. But he's um in 78, 79 he got off of that, yeah. But he's then He's then going and sparring with, sparring with Shorey. Because uh, I come out in 1978, 79, I was on unlicensed fighting, but Johnny Bindon was also training with Roy Shaw for the unlicensed fights. This is what makes me laugh, right? He went down to, it was either the Hippodrome or Stringfellas. I think it was more likely to be Stringfellas than the Hippodrome because Johnny Bindon was a bit, um, bit, of, a, bit of a boy. He's a bit of a man's man and woman's. He, they loved the birds, loved him, and the guys didn't, you know, anyway. But he's in there, he's having a good drink, he's really enjoying himself, he's dancing about, everybody loves him. All the birds are on his case. Now, I believe that Lenny McLean was either on the door or in there. And Joe and, and Johnny Bindon, he's had a few drinks, he's had a champagne, he's had a bit of gear. He's, uh, he don't care about, he, ain't, he don't care, he just don't care, and he's shouting his mouth about. And all, evidently, Lenny McLean's uh, said something to him, and he pulled Lenny, Lenny over in the corner, he said, listen you, he said, he said, don't worry about Lenny McLean, he said, you don't fight me. He said, you wanna fucking fight, get outside. He said, get outside, we'll have a row, yeah? This is, I think it's definitely string fillers. So Len McLean didn't want to know. He didn't want to, he didn't want to know. He knew who he was, Johnny but He didn't want to know. He didn't ch hit, him on the, hit him on the chin inside string fillers. He just left it, yeah? So what, Len, what, uh, Johnny Binder went up to war again. So, but sorry, went up to Lenny again and put it on Lenny, yeah? Lenny said, he just didn't want to know. He just didn't, the guy, this guy's telling me, right? He said, Lenny he did, didn't want to know. So then, uh, Johnny Bindon walked outside uh, Stringfellas and waited outside Stringfellas and gets called Lenny McLean out to come outside. Lenny wouldn't come out. So Johnny Bindon went, right? He went, got all the way ashore about three or four weeks, three or four weeks later, uh, started going back down the gym with Roy Shaw and he said to Roy Shaw that he would put it on Lenny in Stringfellas. Right. Roy said, yeah, he said, he said, I'll put it on Lenny and then string for this. He didn't want to know, mate. He didn't want to come outside and have a fight with me. He didn't want to know. He said, you know what? He said, I want to fight that uh, Lenny McLean. He said, I want to fight him. I'm going to smash him to pieces. He thinks he's big time Charlie Potatoes. He's a fucking wanker, right? This is what he's telling Roy Shaw. Roy Shaw, Joe Pyle, this is what I've been told, went up to uh, Frankie Warren, put it on Frankie Warren about, Joe, about, about Johnny Bindon fighting Lenny McLean. Evidently, evidence is there, what I've been told, that Lenny McLean refused to fight Johnny Bindon. He wouldn't have it, mate. He, would, he did not want to fight, he did not want to fight Johnny Bindon. For some reason, he didn't want to fight him. Whether or not he's, he thought he was going to get stabbed up like, like later, but I don't know. But he would not fight Johnny Bindon. And Johnny Bindon, right, evidently, uh, when he was when he was uh, spying with Roy Shaw, he, evidently he reckoned he put him on the floor. This guy was telling me that he was spied with Roy Shaw and put Roy Shaw on the deck, Johnny Bindon. So I don't know what all this. I should imagine a lot of it's true. The truth. I can't believe it. It's made me feel. I'm. I feel so good about it. You know what I mean? Because uh, Johnny Bindon's a bit of a lad. Uh, you know what I mean? But I didn't realise Johnny Bindon put it on. Pull it on Lenny McLean. Anyway, this is Bang Bang Rail. Uh, just please press the like button and subscribe. But, mate, I'm so excited about this one. I'm so excited. It's a nice one.